All right. Okay, I'm pretty sure that I am now officially streaming on Ikello Photo. My name's Ikello Herod, and this is Ikello Photo. Uh, I'm always thinking that this is a weird and awkward thing when I start one of these, uh, but I wanted to get a piece of content out today, and uh, I wanted to talk really about uh, my camera, my Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 6K Pro. Uh, the, let's see, um, the camera, I've had it since April. Ah! I've had it since April, and it's basically a workhorse. It's pretty, I, I've got a little kit lens on it, because right now my lens is in the shop. I want to talk about it, but it's in the shop. I'm getting it back, and it'll be fine, hopefully. But uh, I'm using this little kit lens because it has a lot of the same advantages. It is image stabilized. It is uh, zoom and um, it's autofocus, and so it does a lot of what I need it to do really quickly. The monitor on top is a Field World 7-inch monitor. Um, I'm sure it has a designation on it, but it has uh, a lot of uh, advantages, including things like false color all built into it, but I don't need that because I've got the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 6K Pro. <laughs> All right, so some of the things that I've learned when using this camera is its versatility. So I was not feeling well last night. Uh, I had had some awful cramps the night before. I mean, I had to call in to work the next, uh, that morning, and I wasn't exactly feeling like going to this game, uh, the football game last night, and I went anyway. I didn't mind going because it was beautiful. Uh, the whole thing was beautiful. I'm going to be putting a whole film out about the entire preseason and my feelings about it and how much I enjoyed doing it. But right now, <laughs> I'm talking about the versatility of what I did last night. So I took this camera and I took the battery off of this thing. And it obviously didn't have this on it, and uh, it had uh, it had there we go. It had this, which is a let's see if I can get it to focus in on it. Will it? There we go. It is a uh, small rig uh, holder for a hard drive that usually goes on top where this monitor is mounted. So what I did was I took this off, took off the hard drive, took off the battery grip, and all I had was this little kit lens and this camera and they let me bring that sucker through security at the Seahawks game lickety split. It was pretty amazing. I had a blast. It was wonderful. You know, I need to start recording on, I'm going to record this on my OBS software. There we go. So just in case you're tuning in for the first time, my name's Ikello Herod. And I have a unique perspective on photography. I like to direct my actors and actresses is what I like to call them. They're models, obviously, but in the moment they're acting, no matter what they're doing, whether they're doing high fashion or some other esoteric form of modeling, like cosplay or, um, let's see, or... Uh, sports photo shooting or you know you're posing people specifically to show off something like athletic wear or something like that all right so what else do i want to talk about today ah 
let's talk about what else. All right, so when you strip it down like that, you need to be able to still have the ability to record. So I, let's see, I took, oh my goodness, do I not even just have a mock-up dummy one? Ah, there we go. I took an SD card, just a plain old SD card. It was a 128 gig SD card, and I put it in there, and then I cranked down the quality setting from 6K to 1080p, if you can believe it. And I'm telling you what, once I scale that up and maybe even scale some of that 6, uh, uh, 6K down, it's going to be very comparable to each other, all from the same lens, all from the same camera. Uh, what else do I want to talk to you about today? Um, part of what I'm doing is my M50 is now working on my, on my Mac M1. Uh, the Mac M1 is... It's a godsend because it was a cheap computer that I could buy, that I could do all the things that I need to do on YouTube. I, I bought a, a like maybe a $1,000 computer, if that, <laughs> and uh, I was able to use it to edit 6K video. It was a little sluggish, though, when I did some of the editing of 6K video. And then, two days ago, Black Magic Design came out with what I consider a great update to DaVinci Resolve 17. It's 17.43 or something like that. And this thing is supposed to increase the speed of the way that you deal with Black Magic Raw footage by three times. Makes it three times as fast. I am having a hard time believing that that's the truth, but it actually is. So anyway, um, let's see. What else do I want to talk about? I think that that's it. The last main reason why I'm doing this is to see if it's going to work, if this, if this uh, M50 is going to work well. I've got it boomed on one of my... See, I've got this arm right here. See this arm? I've got my uh, my M my uh, M50 boomed on. There we go. I've got my M50 boomed on a a very similar arm, just like this. It's such a small camera that I can kind of get away with murder. <laughs> anyway, I hope I didn't crank around too much and make too much sound with all of that. Anyway. Um, I don't think that there's anything else I want to talk about, and I hope that this stream works out pretty well. I've even put a, what I consider an interesting, let's see. A interesting, uh, oh, I lost my train of thought. <laughs> I lost my train of thought. Uh, I... I'm very excited that I hope that I get to do this every Sunday because I'm off on Sundays. That's my deal with the bucks of gods is that I am off on Sundays because football, football, and more football. But between football, I can do myself a live stream while I'm trying to edit things and get those films that I like to do for you out. So anyway, my name's Ekel O'Hara, and I hope that you could like and subscribe if this kind of increased your value of what you want to do with the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 6K Pro and the Canon M50. They just came out with a new one, the Canon M50 Mark II. There's a $20 difference between the two of them, and it's really no difference at all if you get the Canon Webcam Utility. And that's basically what we're using right now is the Canon Webcam Utility. So like, subscribe, if you liked this video and you want more of what I got to give you, my name's Ekel O'Hara, and I want you to love the coming. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, my name's Ekel O'Hara, and I want you to love the camera. 
that you are with. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just cannot. Anyway, have a good day, y'all. That's it for the stream. And hopefully we'll do this again next Sunday. This is a test of the Ikello photo photography system. <laughs> Love that camera that you're with, y'all. Love it. Every day.